Hey guys, quick video on the arenas that are going in. So let's just jump right into it. To get to the arenas, uh, what you'll want to do is, and you can only use this in town, in one of your houses, or a house that you're friended in. Uh, go to quests, go to your arenas, list arenas, and then pick one. And we're going to go to the, and it's going to, it's like, uh, it's casting recall. You can use it with any character though, you don't need Majory or anything. Uh, one other important thing to note about this area that you're going to, you can't use that feature or run into this area um, if you're recently in combat, uh, sort of like recall. So there's roughly a two minute uh, time frame where you can't be fighting or anything and you can't run into this area because inside of this area there is no attacking, there's no skill gain, uh, there's no nothing. So. You can't enter this area if you recently murdered someone or to try and elude someone and get to this area and they can't touch you. That won't exist. You'll get a message that you can't enter this area. So be forewarned. You can't go here and get and get safety. The other thing is you can't go here and do trades. There's no trade windows. So that way you can't come here and have a completely safe area to trade or gain skill or do anything. The only thing you can do are watch fights and chat with people. So anyway, let's get to the uh, getting a team and getting in there so you can get some action going. First off, you got to go to one of these uh, vendors, and it's an arena vendor to buy a basically a ticket for your team. And so it's only three gold right now, but who knows what will actually be in the game. So after you purchase it, you'll get, I have a couple others in here, but you'll get one of these little deeds, you double click it and you name your team and we'll name ours uh, team 2v2 because I've already named, I've already have a uh, have one for 1 verse 1 and so for a 1 verse 1 team you just name it whatever you want and hit OK and that'll automatically create your 1 verse 1 team but that'll be your only 1 verse 1 team for the season we'll get into that later but for now here's how to do a, a multiple one we do a 2 verse 2 and then we need to add my partner we're going to use this guy right here who's my alt and then you need to accept it over here. Okay, uh, the, your partner needs to accept it. So now that's accepted, come back, name your team. And he's in here, and this is my name. You can see the difference by the apostrophe, but anyway. So you hit OK, and now we have a two versus two team. So you come over to the board, you double click it. Here's my initial team that I made before the recording. Uh, here's the one we just made, the two versus two. And now you can make a, a 3v3 team. Down here is the arrows you can select. There will also be a UR a Renaissance era. Here are the rules, and this is kind of important. Uh, chaos means anything goes. And that's this one we have checked here. And when I say anything goes, literally anything, you can use magic weapons like Vanks, you can use poison weapons, you can use any potion you want. Uh, magic armor, you can cast paralyze, you can cast reactive armor, you can do all that stuff. Now, it's going to be a little Dexter friendly, especially with these smaller rooms, so be forewarned. Down here is order. This is important because this is a standard mage, one verse one rule set, no casting reactive armor, no using magic weapons. The only potions you can use are red potions. Um, so keep that in mind. Now, if you do have magic items on you or potions on you, those are going to go straight into your bank. Uh, so you don't lose them and you can't use them during the fight. And over here in options, ranked match. This is important because your ranked match, it's clearly stated here, but just to reemphasize, it's going to use whatever your current skills are of your character that you made this ticket with. So if you have, you know, 50 strength and you go in here and try and fight a ranked match, you're going to fight with 50 strength. Uh, but So keep that in mind. Here for the unranked, uh, almost like practice, you can set your skills, play around with different skill sets, but make sure, even if you are already 7x going into this and you are just going for practice, make sure you set your skills anyways because it's going to use whatever you have selected here in this blue skills button. So let's take a look at that. Now here's all the skills you can use. I've already set my strength and stuff beforehand, so that's why this is pre-filled. But otherwise, this will be all. Each one of these will be 40 for your um, strength, dex, and intelligence. You obviously want to change that. Um, and these are also filled in as well uh, because this is what I have selected for my one verse one. But normally, this will all be zeros. So make sure to go in here and set these. You can pick armor, but 
one thing to keep in mind, you can't just log into the server, come straight here, buy a ticket, set your skills, and be ready to fight, because you'll either need weapons if you're a Dexter, which this doesn't provide weapons, or you'll need a, a mage book uh, if you are a mage. So you got to put some skin into the game and either go out and get enough to get a you know spell book with the spells you want in it, or just go buy a full spell book. So you got to go out and get enough money to at least do that, and then you can come here and practice you know all you want. So our skills, once you go in here and set your skills, make sure you limit yourself to seven here. This is the standard tank mage setup uh, with these skills you see. And then you hit OK. You'll get a message in the bottom left corner saying it's saved. You come back here. Now you can pick which team you want to use if you and your buddy want to fight. Just make sure to select you know, your, two versus two te your two versus two teams. You can go out there and fight other 2v2 guys that are in the queue. And the queue is set up kind of like Call of Duty or Halo. It's constantly trying to find people that are within your um, skill points. So everyone has 1,500 skill points going in. And if you start losing, you start dropping off on some points. And But if you're winning, your points go up. And the matchmaker is going to try and find people closest to the level you are at. So you're not constantly going up against top tier guys unless you and, say, you have a low score and a guy who's the best on the server are the only two people on queued for the particular options you have selected after a while it will select you and you guys will get to fight um, so keep that in mind now to check out how you're doing you can go here to the leaderboard but make sure you select whichever one you're fighting in most commonly if you want to see yourself um, but come here check out the leaderboard and it'll break it down one verse ones two verse twos three verse threes and it's important to note here that there's going to be seasons that way someone can't just camp at the top and be top dog and the last time they played was a year ago. So there's going to be seasons. That way it's always the freshest who's there actively playing. Okay, guys, so when you're done with that, uh, what you'll want to do is cancel it, um, come back to here, and let's just get a look at what the queue looks like. Say you are a mage and you want to practice some. You came in here, you set your skills, you want that mage rule set, you hit OK. Now that's going to throw you in the queue that you see right here, and it's going to let you know it's just a practice one, but it is order and IPY is the era. If you're doing the Renaissance era, it's going to say UOR. Um, so keep that in mind. If you and your buddy decide you want to go do something or whatever, you can hit the cancel button, you're out of the queue, you're not going to get pulled in, and you can go do whatever you want. Guys, last thing, you cannot pick your opponent. So if you and your buddy want to practice on each other, you're going to have to go somewhere else. It's going to be based on whatever your arena point total is. It's going to be trying to constantly match make you with someone with a similar uh, skill point total. So keep that in mind. Thanks guys.